18 months ago, I was overweight, living in New York City, working at a job I didn't really like, earning six figures, but hating my life and barely making ends meet. Now I live in Indonesia. I go freediving and spearfishing every day. My body fat percentage is a lot lower than it used to be, and my chances of getting skin cancer later in life are probably a lot higher. I'm a freediving instructor and an English teacher. Now I work two days a week instead of five. I used to take the weekend off of work to pursue my interests, but now I take the weekend off of pursuing my interests to work. I earn way less money now than I used to, but that's okay because things in Indonesia are a lot less expensive than things in New York. Now I ride a motorbike instead of the subway, rarely wear shoes, and never wear a helmet. But most importantly, I freedive and spearfish every single day. <laughs> I used to wear a business suit, now I wear a wetsuit. I used to wear Oxford shoes, but now I wear dive fins, or I go barefoot. I used to wear underwear, and now I don't. My life is very different now than it was two years ago, and I know the exact day that the transformation began. September 7th, 2018. That was the day that Elon Musk smoked a joint on the Joe Rogan podcast. I had never heard of Joe Rogan, but I wanted to see Elon get high. And the next few weeks after watching that first podcast with Rogan and Musk, I did almost nothing in my free time except for watch more Joe Rogan podcasts. One of them was an interview with this ultra-running bow hunter named Cameron Haynes. And I was so inspired by these guys that I started training for a marathon that same day and ran one 20 days later. I bet you I'm the only person finishing this marathon and smoking the jewel immediately afterwards. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Fuck marathons. This shit sucks. Boring, painful. Are you videotaping me? Fuck. I am a huge fan of Joe Rogan. His podcast is inspiring. His guests are extremely smart. And I... Love Joe Rogan. Anyways, at the risk of coming off as even more of a fanboy than I already am, if that's possible, Joe Rogan and his guests often talk about pursuing your interests in life rather than money. And at the time, I, I was desperately ready to do that. And so I saved some money, quit my job, moved to Asia, and here I am. But pursuing pleasure in inexpensive places around the world is not really that much better than working a nine to five job. In my opinion, learning, creating, and doing cool things is what it's all about. And that's what this channel is about as well. Here in Indonesia, my expenses are really low. I pay $300 a month for a beautiful villa, a few dollars a day for food, and a dollar a day for my motorbike. My largest expense, by far, is my uncontrollable urge to keep buying new spear guns. Anyways, I'm obsessed with the ocean, freediving, and spearfishing. 
and I plan to make more pieces of content about those things. Enjoy. Also, my hair is way longer than it used to be. You should see my pubes.